Hey, Warrior Nation, and welcome back to another edition of the Weekly Warrior, your home for the latest updates of all things Merrimack College Athletics. I'm your host, Claire Foley. Now, last week we didn't put out an episode, so there's a lot to cover today, but we first want to give a quick shout out to Women Swimming, who earned their first win of the season just before the holiday against Simmons, finishing with a final score of 174 to 88. Women's basketball also had an impressive win last week over Dartmouth, finishing 73-65. to Women's basketball is currently on their way to Big Blue Nation as they prepare to take on Kentucky on Sunday. All right, let's go break down those scores. So first, here's a look at the scores from before Thanksgiving. Of course, we have women's swimming's impressive win, but we also had two wins by men's basketball and one each from men's and women's hockey. Now taking a look at the scores from just after Thanksgiving, um, and it was pretty quiet due to the holiday, but that Saturday was where women's basketball pulled out their big win over Dartmouth. Time to take a look at the week ahead. Make sure you pause here to take your screenshots so you know where to be or where to watch. Hitting the road, we have women's swimming, women's hockey, men's and women's track making their winter debut, and women's basketball in the Bluegrass State. Only three home events this week, and two of those three are happening inside of Lawler Arena. Men's hockey game against UConn was postponed, but we have women's hockey on Friday against BU, and men's basketball makes the rink into a court on Saturday against UMass Lowell. As of right now, this is the last time men's basketball is scheduled to play in Lawler this season, so make sure you are there. It was an absolute blast last time, and it definitely will be again. Men's Hoops will be back in Hamill for their game against Brown on Tuesday. As always, come out to support these teams in person if you can. Otherwise, head to MerrimackAthletics.com for live stats and updates of all these games. And don't forget to show your support on social media, tagging the teams and using the hashtag GoMac. That does it for another edition of the Weekly Warrior. I'm your host, Claire Foley. Thank you for watching, and we hope to catch you on the next one.